you spending your New Year's Eve? Are you heading to a fancy party, hanging out with some friends, or staying in with your family? Here's a dose of joy with her view of celebrating the end of the year. Hey, are you one of those people who never had any real fun on New Year's Eve? Bet you don't like disco either. Because that's what it is, one big champagne pop and limo riding glitter disco blast at some hotel banquet room that's overpriced. Or somebody's basement where they hung up a mirrored ball to get the feel of a hotel banquet room that's overpriced. Maybe you just don't like forced partying, especially after all those Christmas and holiday parties. And the last thing you want to do is go anywhere with all those drunks out on the road. You just want to go to bed, don't you? But you know you're going to be awakened by all those firecrackers and bullets being shot up in the air. And you can only hope they come back down and hit all those drunks out on the road. But it doesn't have to be this way. You can stay home with the kids, make popcorn, play board games, and watch the ball drop on TV with all those champagne pop and limo ride and glitter disco force partying party people. They can have their mirrored balls because you've got an eight ball. Remember those magic eight balls? That's all you need. Forget about all that New Year's resolution stuff. Just ask the magic eight ball. And if you don't get the answer you like, you can do it again till you get the one you like. Like I always say, resolutions, smezolutions. Well, okay, I don't always say that, but I say it a lot. But I'm going to make a resolution to change that this year. I'm Trey Gridnick. Well, thanks for watching.